United States based lawyer Ketum Daramola has accused a stranger husband Adetokumbo Daramola of plans to legally acquire the jointly owned property in Lagos. Ketu had accused her husband of abandoning her and her four children in the United States and returning to Nigeria, where he got his mistress to start living with him in her house. She further accused her husband, a businessman who executed contract for the Lagos Inland Revenue Service and his mistress, of calling to legally acquire the jointly owned property in Lagos. The property in question is a twin duplex at Magodo in Lagos. In 2010, Mr. Daramola partly relocated to Nigeria, where he began executing contracts for the Lagos Inland Revenue Service and some local government areas in the state. Mrs. Daramola said she contributed 75% of the money spent on building the house and furnishing most part of their home. She alleged that, unknown to her, her husband while in Nigeria began an affair with another married woman. Upon completion and furnishing of their home, her husband and the mistress moved into the house. Also accused him of having an illicit relationship with a woman whose husband was in the United Kingdom. In August 2018, Mrs. Daramola said why she was buying the furniture and other home items to the U.S. and shipping them to Nigeria. Her estranged husband, who was claiming the properties in Lagos, was giving his mistress the impression that he was an American big boy. Mrs. Daramola said she visited Nigeria in May 2019 unannounced only to find female items all over their home. She, she said her husband did not know the owner of the items. She said by her next visit to Nigeria, the locks of the house had been checked by her husband's mistress. She accused the woman of planning to take over the house with her mother. Mrs. Daramola said she hired a lawyer in Nigeria and began filing legal notice against them. She said she has received several threats from the mistress and her mother that they will kill her within six months. After all these troubles and struggles, the woman later won the case and recover her house. No, 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 they cannot trust you. Cannot here. For you. here, for here. Who the hell is Tokumo Daramola? You fugitive from justice. Before me, because of me, you did not go to get the new justice. I want to clean up your conviction. You want to, you were already convicted. You were already convicted. I clean it up. You were convicted. I clean it up for you. You bastard. I told all your bleach. I told all your Yes. This is my talk bear, the young talk bear. Talk bear, say hello. hello. Hey, poor thing, eh? Talk bear is a victim in all this, so this is me, I pay talk bear. Oh. This is me in my house. 
And I give glory and honor to God for giving me victory, victory, victory. That's me. I'm going upstairs now. I'm videotaping my house. The devil is a bastard. And all his co hosts, their names are poverty. My husband said he gave a standing order that I should not enter the house. He gave my photograph to the security at the gate. But then, when I sent copies of the um, C of O to them, they turned around and they told me that um, they are not uh, an arbiter, an association for marital disputes, and that I have put, given them enough proof to show that uh, I am a co-owner of the house. And so legally, he cannot uh, lock me out of the house. So I thank God this is my daughter's bedroom, which we furnished. These are all the curtains. We furnished everything. I furnished these are my son's bedroom. That Abisoye Shitabe Osivaya Kolawale wants to come and claim. She probably was thinking to come here in this December to come and read my room in a house that she did not build, in a marriage, in a, in a home that she did not build. All this furniture was bought from Raymond Flanagan and Bo, uh, Bob's uh, furniture stores. I shipped them, cleared them, and I'm still paying for some of them. This furniture here I bought, I think about eight or nine years ago. I bought it when we had the little, uh, uh, the little bungalow where the four duplexes now stand. And uh, I, I remember buying this refrigerator in December uh, at Grants. I think Bissoye's dreams are in there. But uh, God has just confitted them. God has given me victory. And I'll continue to walk in victory because God is a God of righteousness. And I thank him for everything. So this is it. This is our bedroom. This is it. These are all my things. This is my wardrobe. I'm going to open it. You know. These are all the things I bought as well. All the air freshener, beddings and stuff. Everything here was shipped by me. Uh, and I pray women in diaspora, you have to be very smart. The women out there right now have taken over the men, they've bewitched them, giving them all kinds of food to eat so that they can swing.